south, I'm gonna have myself time. Friendly faces everywhere, humble folks without temptation. Going down south, I'm gonna leave my world behind. Am I parking day or night? People spouting how they never. Heading on up south, I'm gonna see if I can't unwind. <laughs> Come on down south, I'll then meet some friends of mine. So Wendy, how are you enjoying brunch so far? Well, I can tell you that it went better than I expected. Well that's good. I figured that since all the Skank Hunt 42 bullcrap is out of the way, I thought that we could do something together, you know, like old times. Um, this isn't just to get us back together, right? Nope, not at all. I wouldn't just force you to continue the relationship, no, I'd just leave the decision up to you. Either way, I'll be fine. Wow, thanks Dan. You sure have matured over the years. I can't even remember the last time you threw up whenever I talked to you. Well, I... What the hell was that? Everybody, get on the fucking ground. Look sir, I can give you all the money in the cash register. Just please don't hurt anyone. No thanks, I have no interest in your currency, I'm in need of a person. Who exactly are you looking for? Do you know anyone by the name of... Robbie Lee Phillips Jr? Nope, never heard of him. Oh really? Well here's our picture of him. If you ever see this man in your restaurant, give me a call. My number is on the back of the photo. Now if you'll excuse me, I'm gonna go ask a certain elementary school the same question. Come on Wendy. Let's get the hell out of here. Going somewhere? Yeah, as far away from you as possible. You look familiar, don't I know you from somewhere? Nope. Never met you. Wait, I know you. You're a friend of the fat kid who resurrected Robbie. What are you talking about? He just appeared out of the blue and sang his annoying theme song. Come on kid, did you really think everything that happened during the On Top of the World music video was just a dream sequence? Wait. All that bullcrap with Carpen going to heaven and rescuing the teleporting fat guy while blowing up the heaven school, that actually happened? Of course, it happened, now tell me. Where? Is- Listen, I have no idea where he is. I haven't seen him since Kalo inflated Oliver three years ago. And even if I did, I still wouldn't tell you. You don't know who you're dealing with. I'm Bart fucking Reynolds. I can make your life a living hell. Now until you bring me the blood port and fat by. Hey. I'm taking your girlfriend. Wendy. No. I didn't want her to come to this, but you leave me no choice. So long, Marsh. Help me, Stan. Wendy. No oh 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 oh. Don't worry, Wendy. I'll save you from that bastard. But I can't do it alone, so I'm gonna have to get some help. <laughs> Why think so mean to me? I just want to be your friend. <laughs> oh my god, I hate Willie's plaguey puss form. His voice is so annoying. Not only that, he looks like Perry the plaguey puss from Phineas and Ferb. I wouldn't be surprised if whoever made this monstrosity ends up in a lawsuit with Disney. Willie totally deserves to get his ass kicked by those bullies. Carmen, why must you complain about everything? Chill out you, I was just expressing my opinion about this series. It's called Freedom of Speech, you dumb kike. Didn't you learn that in school? Yeah, and you know what else I learned? That you are a fat lazy prick who doesn't do his schoolwork. Instead, you just daydream about random shit. That's why you learn nothing in school. Shut up you. Stay out of this you poor piece of crap. Kenneth Vincent McCormick III, you shut the hell up, no one cares about your existence, you trash. Hey, fat ass. Holy crap, Stan, what the hell is it? Guys, you will not believe what happened during my date with Wendy. She did she for Clyde? Worse. She has been taken hostage by some man named Bart Reynolds. He claimed to have met us before. That's terrible. We should report this to the police. That won't work. Bart Reynolds is very strong and powerful. The police will be no match for him. And how do you know that fat ass? 
because he's the deporting fat guy's arch nemesis. He has kidnapped Rackle and gathered a league of mustached villains to take over the world. I know that because I have seen every episode of that series. I was devastated about Robbie's final sacrifice to stop him. That's where I went to heaven and brought him back. Wait, that actually happened? I thought that was just a dream sequence. Yeah, I was just as surprised as you dude. Wait, why haven't you told us? Because you never asked. Nobody did. No Kenny, not even our superhero alter egos are strong against him. We need someone with more experience. And lucky for us, I know just the person. Alexa, turn off the alarm. Okay Robbie, the alarm is off. Ah, what a beautiful day. I wonder what dad made for breakfast. Good morning dad. Good morning son. I made your favorite, chocolate chip pancakes with whipped cream on top. Thanks dad. You are the best. Wow, he's growing up so fast. If only my wife was still around to see it. Dad makes some good pancakes, doesn't he? Yeah, he sure does. He should make his own cooking show. Well, the ones that I hop are better, but these are good too. So, what should we do today? Damn it fat ass. You're kneeling on my foot. Oops, sorry Ollie. And another thing, don't call me Ollie. Well what about Ollie Wally? Ha 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 No. I will not be called that ridiculous name, that is unless you want to be vaporized by my butt cannon. Ha 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 ha. Relax little buddy, it's just a joke. We wouldn't actually consider calling you that. But would you prefer Olive Garden? Ha 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 Yesterday, I got this new app. It's called Truth or Dare. It follows the rules of the original game, but it already has truths and dares in the game. Wanna play? Um, no thanks. I'd rather get inflated again. Oh really? Um, 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 um. Fine. I'll play the bloody game. Now get rid of that damn pump. That's the spirit. Okay, I've already put our names in. Now let's begin. Wow, I'm a poet, and I didn't even know it. Rachel. Okay, sorry. I got a little carried away. Anyway Robbie, truth, or dare? Dare. Okay, I dare you to do an improvised dance. Okay. Wow, that was really good. Thanks, I learned it from my mom. After she died in that gruesome car accident, I vowed to dance this way in her memory. Well I'm gonna pick, truth. If I had to marry anyone in this room, who would it be? Obviously Robbie, because he saved my life countless times. Also, he isn't as crabby as Oliver. Aw, oh, thanks Rachel. Yeah, thanks for calling me crabby, now when's it gonna be my turn? Hold on, just gotta get through this ad. And, we're back, so what's your pick? Duh. I wanna prove I'm just as tough as Robbie. Wow, that's a shock. Well who asked you fat ass? Oh no. What? What's the matter Rachel? It's this dare. 
you are unable to do it. What do you mean I'm unable to do it? Are you saying I'm not tough enough? No Oliver, it has nothing to do with that. It's because you're an animal you can't do this dare. Well just because I'm a honey badger doesn't mean I'm uncapable of taking challenges. It can't be too difficult for me. Let me see this dare. Play the rest of this game wearing only your underwear. You're an animal, and animals don't wear any clothes, not even underwear. So this dare is impossible for you. Therefore, you have no other choice than to forfeit this round. Oh, crap. Here are the scores for round one. You and I have one point, while Oliver has zero points. Wow, poor Oliver. How could this happen to me? I made my mistakes, got nowhere to run. The night goes on as I'm fading away. I'm sick of this life, I just wanna scream. How could this happen to me? Hey guys, sorry to interrupt, but we've got some visitors. Visitors? visitors? Holy crap! This place is huge! I know. It's even bigger than my mansion in Sims 3. Now remember guys, we're not here to look around, we're here for the clipboarding fat guy. Yeah we know the fat ass. Just making sure. Hey fellers. Jesus Christ butters, you scared us half to death. Oh I'm sorry Eric, I didn't mean to scare you. I promise it will never happen again. What the hell are you doing here anyway? Well, I was just randomly passing by this mansion, then I saw you guys walking in, so I decided to tag along. So what brings you to this humble manor? Did one of you win the lottery or something? Actually, we came here for... Eric? Eric Cartman? Yes Robbie. It's me. It's so good to see you again. Well then come upstairs with me. The others are waiting. We've got a lot of catching up to do. So, um, Robbie, who are these guys? Well Rachel, this youngster right next to me is Eric Cardman, he's an old friend of mine. And these are my friends Butters, Kenny, Kyle, and Stan. Dude, this is getting pretty fucked up here. Well it's nice to meet you kids. I'm Robbie's father, and the girl is Robbie's wife Rachel. Hold on, wife? You mean you two are? Married? Yes. We had our wedding last spring. Anyway Robbie, tell us how you met these adorable children. Eric here has rescued me from a permanent death. Afterwards, we've been on so many adventures. I remember it like it was just yesterday. Mom, I'm going to save the clipboarding fat guy. Okay hun. Be back by supper. Get out of the school and meet me outside. I have arrived. Uh, 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 uh. Oof. Where am I? What year is this? It's the same year, just six months later. Who the hell are you anyway? Well, I'm the. Where's Oliver? I haven't seen him since our last battle with Bart Reynolds. I hope we run into him at some point. Robbie, you're alive. Oliver, it's been so long. We will have two Big Macs, two sodas, and an Oreo McFlurry. I'm sorry, but we ran out of Oreo McFlurries. How about an M&M McFlurry instead? What? Are you kidding me? I want a goddamn Oreo McFlurry right now. Kevin, stop acting like a spoiled brat. You can either have an M&M McFlurry, or you can have nothing at all. I've got a better idea. Why don't you go across the street and buy some condoms? Cause at least we'll be safe if you're gonna fuck me mom. That's it. You are grounded 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 for life. Wow. We should probably go. Eric, I'm going to Rhode Island for the weekend. I'll be back honey. I will stay here and watch Drake and Josh. I will watch it too because I love Drake and Josh. They're my heroes. Why Butters? Why? Butters? Why? Anyway, let's get on with the tour.
How does this feel bitch? I'm gonna kill you fat ass. Not today you son of a bitch. Died again. We did it. We saved Columbine High School. We did it. To prevent bullying. Thanks guys. If it wasn't for you, we all would have. Rachel. No. No. Wow. You're coming with me, you time traveling bastards. Guys, look. We're headed straight for that black hole. Jesus Christ. We're all gonna die. Is there anything we can do to get out of here? Well, there is one way. Robbie can go into the cockpit, turn this ship around, and fly us home. No. Why not? Because he tried to kill us. Well, it's either that, or we all die in the black hole. Just do it, Robbie. You can shun Steve later. Fine. I'll go to the cockpit. Look, me and my friends are stranded in space, and we need to get home now. Yeah, but I don't wanna go. Why are a a a a off? Are you at the cockpit yet? Yeah, but the driver is acting crazy. Crazy? I'll show you crazy. Look at me. I inflated myself. Is this crazy enough for you? Oh my god. Don't worry. I've got this. Thanks, Steve. No problem. Now let's head back to Earth. Yeah. Wow, you guys have been on quite an adventure. I wish I could have been there. Um, sorry to kill the mood, but... My girlfriend has been kidnapped by Bart Reynolds. What? How is that possible? I thought he was dead. Oh? So that's why you came here. You wanted to get Robbie to help save Wendy from Bart Reynolds. I knew this day would come. Follow me everyone. Listen guys, since our last battle, Bart must have gotten stronger during resurrection, like me. So if we're gonna take him down, we have to. And just where do you think you are going Stanley? Um. 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 Um.